Oh, I know, they're under construction like mm -hmm. the rest of the nation. You bet. All right, wishing them the best. Today, closer to home, though, I could definitely feel the chill in the air. I it know. was considerably different. You yeah. may have wanted 80 degrees in sunshine. <laughs> we didn't get that at least to start the day, did we? No, we're uh, <laughs> so far the high 65 That's it. in Indianapolis, yes. And we uh, we needed the rain. We got mm -hmm. that yesterday. Yep. I'm sure it ruined some grad parties and other outdoor events from time to time tomorrow. But we were tied for the driest first 10 days of June. We didn't have any rain measurable at the airport in Indianapolis June 1st through the 10th. And we have to look back to 1984 for the last time that happened. So we definitely needed the rain. 0.64 in the rain gauge yesterday. We do have more rain on the way for tomorrow. And we still need the rain. 0.64 what we got yesterday. But we are still about an inch and a third below where we should be for this time of year. No rain tonight. Beautiful view of Monument Circle on this somewhat cloudy and very cool June day. We still have mainly cloudy skies in 64. It's been breezy as well. Winds are out of the northwest at 14. 65. That's it this afternoon. Obviously quite a bit colder than our average high of 81. Our low this morning 53. Our average low is 62. Sunset this evening happens at 913. Uh, find the umbrella again for tomorrow. Scattered showers and thunderstorms storms in your Tuesday forecast. The day will start with a rain chance. Then I think we get some dry hours for the middle part of the day before some pockets of heavier rain and maybe a couple of thunderstorms redevelop tomorrow afternoon into tomorrow evening. At this point, we're not expecting severe weather storm. Prediction Center doesn't have us under that threat, but something we'll keep a close eye on. We're watching this little weak weather system in between Minneapolis and Milwaukee. It's going to start to move our way over the next few hours, so may notice a couple of wet roads for the morning morning drive on Tuesday, but the heaviest rain won't fall until later in the day tomorrow. We can time it out with future track 13. This is Tuesday at 8 a.m. Mentioned a wet road or two, then perhaps a couple of dry breaks here and there as we get into late morning, early afternoon before we get more additional rain developing. Pockets of heavier rain, maybe a couple of thunderstorms. This is 4 o'clock tomorrow afternoon. We'll stop it at 6 p.m. Rain will continue to fall through the evening hours, and then we'll shift south and east as we get into Wednesday. So we're back into some dry conditions Wednesday, but still cool for this time of year. Highs on Wednesday, again, only in the 70s. We'll forecast 70 to 75 the next couple of afternoons. Uh, rain around from start to finish with a few dry breaks. If you have outdoor plans, just check Live Doppler 13 radar first. We're back into the low 80s where we should be for the early half of June on Thursday and Friday. There was a slight rain chance Thursday. We've got it dry Friday and then another weather system to watch right now timing it for later Saturday into early Father's Day morning.